guys, Lego Ball 1238 here. Today is a set review and how to organize, how I organize my Lego. And sorry about the weird noise in the background, that is my brother playing tapped out. So first, let's do the characters. So, the first character is the driver. Um, he's got, he's got like a kind of, he's got a bead on his face. And he's got kind of a frown. He's got clean brown pants. Mr. Pete himself. Um, he's got a belt with a tie on, and he's got a pocket with a pen in. And the back is just the other thing of the belt. So yeah, on to the next character. And this character is the construction worker. He's got plain orange pants. He's got like a kind of a hoodie with a belt. He's got two pockets there. And he's got the things there to make tighten it up. On the back of him, he's got his hood. Walkie talkie. And he's got a beard. And he's... I don't know what facial expression that is. But you do this. The headphones are actually attached to a hat. You cannot take them off. Um, look, you cannot take them off. So yeah, on to the set itself. So um, we're gonna start off with the toilet. Um, it's got three toilet signs. Um, we've got a hook, and I'll tell you what that hook is for in a minute. Um, in the inside, if I can even get this open, the toilet, there is actually a toilet in there, which is good. I like toilets. Um, the toilet roll is there. That's the toilet lid, and, and that's the toilet seat. And that's the flush, I think. I don't know. Then on the wall it has got some tiles and these walls are just um these plates attached to these pieces. I don't know what they're called. I do not like like I know what highly pieces are called, I need lessons. Somebody teach me. Um okay, on the roof you've got Some cheese slopes. So yeah. Um, onto the carriage. So the carriage is attached to the little thingy. Let's take it off. Um, it's got four jumper plates for the toilet to sit on. It's got like got two small wheels. Matthew, can you be sure? Can you just please? Um, sorry about the noise. And then it's got some towels here and some more cheese slopes. So, oh, this thing came off. The license plate. It's got three license plates because if you move the hook thing, it's got one there. And one at the front, which is weird. Um, uh, I reckon I've got it back attached. So, before we do the interior, I'm going to show um, that bit. I'm going to show you what this hook is for. So, you attach the hook is to attach it to attach the toilet to it. I'm going to just lift it, this bit up here a minute. And then you move it. I don't know why it keeps doing that though. Um, I don't know. I shouldn't. I don't usually do that. And then you can just do this. But yeah. So, what we're going to do now. So, this is just 
the tent to pretend to move it. Um, little trash can here. I don't know what this red thing represents. So it's got a bit of glass there. A spade and a broom. It's got these. Um, you can pull these down. So you can. Um, the roof has got two lights with a grill piece and the, it's got another license plate with two stickers at the side. It's got a um, city sticker there, it actually says uh, a city bean, not sticker. Um, got the lights, the mirror thing which can actually move. <coughs> And um, just a nice and plate. The side has got two steps. I don't know what that is. And the wheels. <laughs> There's obviously wheels. I think it's the same on the other side. Yep, it's the same on the other side. It's got open doors that actually open and close. So, yeah, let's get on to the inside. So you can just simply take the roof off, like that. Then it's got a red tile there. Then you can got translucent black beads, translucent. And then obviously you have to have a coffee mug, literally a coffee mug, in every single talk. I don't, I don't get why they could make the roof a bit higher so they could actually put some chairs in there. Maybe you could um, do that yourself, and this thing's came up again. Um, so it's got a blue steering wheel, and that's a little blue table there. So yeah, it's not really much of the inside, but I recommend this set. It's really cool. Um, it's very easy to build. The characters are cool. The accessories are cool. You should get the set. So it is a legacy construction truck. And I really recommend this. I can have said I've said it already. It is very cool. I don't really get sets often. But yeah, it is one of my favourite sets. Literally, I really had. I I don't really get that much cars, but yeah, it's cool. Like I said, um, let's get it. It's amazing. And I want to say bye. So guys, I never meant to say bye. I forgot. I need to organise. Show you how I organise my Lego. You're blocking the camera. Okay. Um, so first... In here I've got some hooks. This is what I'm planning to keep together. Like this guy. I forgot what series is. What I've got, like, for... What set is one? Penguin. Iron Man. And Shaggy and stuff. Shima Girl, Batman, Tyler, um, whatever, Gas, uh, Oil Man. Um, so, this is just a uh, construction site that I'm working on. And here, I need to. Uh, oh, yeah, I'm using these and these. Um, there is the set where I was just doing a review on. In here, um, I've got some base plates, which I'm going to be using for my Star Wars um, claim base, which I've already started. It's in there. It's in there. Then, in here, I've got some accessories and minifigure parts. 
that box is broken to exit. So if you pause that. Um, I just made this little stand. It's not really organized, I think. It just says your payment card. It's not actually my real payment card. Alright. Um, yeah, I've just got a Chima book and two boats. Um, yeah, I've just got a bunch of things which I'm going to show you. Um, I've got this buggy, Star Wars buggy. Which was a part of the set, a part of a set. Sorry about that. This was a part of a set, which I wanted to keep. Um, and sorry about that again. Then I just got a bunch of random other sets in here. I'm going to take these out. This box was only meant to be for stuff, so I just dumped some stuff in there for a minute. For until I get it sorted. So I'm just sticking back and going in the bin. I've got X Wing what my brother made. In here I've got like grey pieces which I do not need. I did have hair in that pencil pot which I made. And in there I've just got some knee driver stuff. So Just some instructions in a big box. Scooby Doo box anymore. Uh, stop it. Uh, stop it. Uh, in. Uh, sorry. Let me just. Open. I just got some pieces which I do not need. Uh, I need to put away. I do need pieces. I need all of my pieces. Um, there's just random stuff. There's just, and in here are some mocks and sets what I'm, um, which I'm not going to destroy. Yeah, anyway. In here, this is a Coast Guard set. Big ship. Um, and that is just big data favor. Um, um, I think that's it. Me too. Um, well, I, I'll just quickly show you the set. Now, this is just out of my box. I guess it's just a uh, little hover thing what I made last night. It's quite bad. Um, This is the construction site which I'm working on. That's the boss's office. And that's going to be a storage area. Uh, and this is their uh, storage area at the moment. Well, they're going to have two. That's going to be for blocks and stuff, and that's going to be for tools. Um, this is Dad's pieces. I've got a phone stand there, which I might use sometimes. Um, I got the penguin versus Batman. Um, Iron Man versus Ultron. And I think that's uh, basically all the sets I've kept together so far. Now um, I've got. Scooby Doo set which I haven't destroyed. But well, Scooby Doo boat. And that, oh and uh, another Coast Guard boat. So yeah. I'll show you, see you in the next episode. Bye.